Hey folks, welcome back to Cape Fear Customs. I'm Alan Gilliland. This is my brother, Matthew Gilliland. We can't wait to tell you all about our new product from Cape Fear Trailers, the Overlanding Trailer Series Mission 1 and Mission 2. Our Overlanding Mission Series style trailers came about from us spending a lot of time camping together and realizing that once you set up the rooftop tent, you were essentially stuck at your campsite. Who well, wants that? Yeah, so with a variety of uh, customers coming in looking for camping options, we decided to come up with a overlanding style trailer to be able to haul all of your gear. Geared directly towards the outdoor enthusiast. This thing's got all types of durability with the Linex protective coating and the thick gauge steel that we use to construct these things. Let me show you some of the cargo area. Flip on the switches for the lights, Matt. Let's show them. Back here, we have a large cargo area that can fit all types of gear and accessories. We can set these things up to whatever specs you're interested in. If you're a hunter, fisher, you know, you like to go camping or backpacking, there's lots of room back here for all your different needs and gear. Tell them a little bit about the way we have the propane set up, Matt. So uh, what we have is a standard propane tank mounted inside the bed with a special clamp from Front Runner Outfitters. Uh, we then tied that into a T to be able to allow connections on both sides. Um, a, a customer can hook a cooktop and use it right off the top fender, or they could run a heater up into their tent to keep them warm in the winter months. Alan, you know, tell us about the forward command cabin. This is the forward command cabinet. This is where all your electronical components can be stored and housed. We have it set up with a deep cycle uh, lithium, lithium ion battery. battery. Uh, you also have your control panel for all your lights and switches. Uh, we have a Red Arc system in here, which is a battery management system. Matt, why don't you tell them all about the Red Arc power system? As our top of the line battery option, the Red Arc has three ways of charging. While you're driving down the road, the tow vehicle charges the battery. You also have a shore power connection and it does have the ability to cook up a foldable solar panel. You know, when thinking about building something like this, there's a lot of things to consider. The durability, the versatility, the adaptability of the piece is all super important to those who are gonna go off-road and enjoy these things in the outdoors. We've made sure to incorporate some features that are gonna make life much easier on the trail. Yeah, like look at this Max Coupler. It allows you to have 360 degrees of articulation. You can really take this trailer just about anywhere. And another piece is we made the tongue just a little bit longer so the customers can be able to open their trunk lid or their rear gate to access the rear. And if you come around to our driver's side of the trailer, we have a couple amenities that help make camp feel like home. One of them being a fridge freezer on the slide. This is gonna allow you to keep all of your cold groceries and drinks secure while you're out doing what you're doing. And keep in mind too, there's multiple different versions of the fridge freezers. You can have a fridge freezer combo that does both the freezing and the fridge part, or you could get one that has two zones that accommodates your frozen foods as well as your refrigerated items. Another nice amenity is, is the Life Straw Jerry Can. Don't forget this, about that. This allows you to have five gallons of water. You can take it from anywhere and it does filter it. Simply pump and you have fresh water on tap. It's all provided through the filters right underneath this nozzle. It's just like your Life Straw. Another option that our customers asked us for on the Mission One Series trailers was a propane hookup, as well as 12 volt USB plugs and a 110 accessory outlet. This allows you to have virtually any type of 110 plug power. And not to mention, these fenders here were designed on purpose to have a flat surface so that you could use it for food prep. It is a food grade material that we spray the trailers with, and you have plenty of lighting to be able to see what you're doing at night. Extreme durability was what we were going after. And these fenders are made with roll cage steel. You are not going to hurt these trailers bumping them up against trees or rocks when you're out there rock crawling or going on your next adventure. Speaking of food prep, we are a Timbo Tough Scottle dealer, so we like to carry these Scottles with us for their collapsibility and carryability. Yeah, and if, one of the nice features too about having the off-road durability of the trailers is a 17-inch wheel with a 33-inch tire. We can put any style wheel and tire on. But underneath, this is a Timbrin suspension. So what this allows is full articulation while maximum clearance in between the two axles. Although standard with a five lug, these trailers can be matched all the way up to an eight lug. That way, any style vehicle can be used with it. That's right, we're Cape Fear Customs. We can do pretty much anything with a SUV or truck. 
To add to the maximum durability, we added 3,500 pound jacks, three of them, two in the back, one in the front. This allows you to get a level campsite when you get to where you're going, or if you were to have some type of wheel or tire damage, you can jack the trailer up right with the jacks that are installed on the trailer, do the tire change, and keep moving. With the Mission 1 or the Mission 2, you don't need a high lift jack in order to make that happen. And there's another item we wanted you to know about, and that has to do with this little guy back here. Under here, you're gonna see the trailer hitch opening. Now this is actually the tongue of the trailer that's gone the entire length of the trailer, so adds extra stability to the trailer, but also gives you an option. Should you get stuck on the trail and the vehicle that's rescuing you can't get to the vehicle, they can pull you out from the trailer. You also can fit any type of two inch hitch receiver accessories like a basket, a bike carrier, or what a else? Step. Like yeah, a step. You yeah, add like a step. You know, while we're back here, we might want to mention that standard on both the Mission 1 and Mission 2 trailers is our chase light. This chase light's used in the Baja 1000 by Trophy Trucks. It not only allows you to run brake lights, it can also do turn signals, hazard lights, and your reverse backup lights. Speaking of having everything that you need, something that's always nice is having an auxiliary water tank. With this tank, it is heated by the sun with its black coating. However, you can add a hot water heater so that you cycle the hot water through. Over here is a shower room with a quick connect shower head, allowing you to have a nice hot shower on the trail. At Cape Fear Customs, we listened to a lot of what our customers had to say and having some of the comforts of home was a big piece of that. Having the ability to have an auxiliary water source to either take a hot shower or rinse off your feet during a day at the beach was something that we were definitely wanting to offer our customers. And the road shower package is available on not only the Mission 1, but also the Mission 2 overlanding trailer. Now, we've also got some neat creature comforts that are gonna be really crucial when you're out there enjoying life off grid, like this rooftop tent. And these rooftop tents are available in a wide variety of platforms. This one being a four person hard shell style. See how quick that was? When we talk about rooftop tents, there's all different versions and types to take a look at. We not only sell the, these Overland Vehicle Systems tents, which can come in both hard shell or soft top, we also sell the Thule brand tents as well. Really, there's a tent for any type of budget. There's a lot of advantages to having a rooftop tent. Not only are you up off the ground, away from all the creepy crawlies and critters and snakes, you also have lots of airflow, which makes for nice sleeping conditions. Plus, with its standard coming with a mattress, comfortability is fantastic. Now, the primary difference between our Mission 1 and our Mission 2 series trailer is our forward command cabin. Right, like you saw before, we house all of our electronic components inside here, but that's okay because you can also do the same thing with the Mission 2, just putting those components inside the main cargo area. And you also have the option of integrating a basket up front, so if you wanted to carry an extra cooler or perhaps some firewood, you could do that right to the campsite. Speaking of fires, one of my favorite things about the trailers is being able to set up the awning right by the campfire. With this ARB awning, set up and take down as a breeze. We just roll the tarp out. And then he holds it. Throw these legs out. Connect them up right here. And next we drop our legs. And we're good to go. Now you might be worried if rainstorm was to come along, what would happen to the water? Well, there is a solution for that. All you got to do is adjust the length of your legs. And you create a slope for the water to escape. Another thing our customers love is our awning lights. These LEDs are bright and they can be ran all night. What do you think, Alan? What do I think? I think mission accomplished. You know, we told you all about the mission one and there's also the mission two, which we've mentioned. This would be the mission two. It's a little smaller, a little cheaper for those budget conscious. 
Plus, this is a great example of the many different ways that we can shoot the Line X in different colors and patterns. People ask about what the difference is between the Mission 1 and the Mission 2. The main difference is the forward command cabin and the rack space above the command cabin. We can't wait for you to come by Cape Fear Customs at 6121 Market Street and put your hands on the Cape Fear Trailers Mission 1 and Mission 2 trailers and really feel the quality of these trailers. Also, check us out at CapeFearCustoms.com.